why does a metal shader look so dull and black? It's a simple question with a simple answer really and if you are familiar with materials please skip this tutorial you know it anyway but I get asked this question quite frequently and actually when I started out with computer animation I thought why is chromium which is such a lovely material looking so black? This is a chap Nicolas Louis Vauquelin who classified chromium as the first person ever. He was a French pharmacist and chemist and he was the discoverer not only of chromium but also of beryllium. So he was one of the main characters here in this science. Chromium is a very hard substance and it looks basically grey, white and grey. It's extremely hard and it's the third hardest element behind carbon in form of diamond and boron. So you can scratch basically anything with, um, with chromium, so it's so hard. And it looks actually very nice and vivid and why look, does it look so black in Maya? Well it has to do with the reflectiveness and the reflectiveness of a metal is totally different from the reflectiveness of, well, let us go back to the Lambert shader. You see there's no reflection, this does just the diffuse light effect on this object. However with this metal here we see only black until we introduce a light and that's the only trick about it. Let's introduce an Arnold light, a sky dome light here and render the scene. And now the chromium looks <laughs> not black anymore. It looks white, pretty dull as well. Because we have a diffuse light which doesn't give us a specific reflection here. So let us delete that light and create an Arnold area light. A space bar to get the um, hotbox here, panels and look through the selected. Now we're looking through that light and we can kind of approach this like here and uh, hotbox again perspective and we want to see the perspective. Now the light is up here and it really shines on our torus. We need much more exposure so maybe four it's going to be very bright and now we do an Arnold rendering again and now you see the chromium at work. It shows up in the viewport as a purely black substance and the same thing happens with all metallic substances. This is the AI standard surface shader. I didn't use a preset, I just set the metalness to 1. When I reduce this we can see the structure and the, the diffuse lighting uh, acting on this surface so it's darker here than here for example. But when we erase this here we get a black object. We can go to the presets and here in the presets we do have chrome. When we render it again we have this because it's even more reflective now. Very nice indeed and uh, let's create some background here. Actually I just import a lighting set which I downloaded a while ago from 32-bit studios. They provided us with a free lighting setup here which is you don't need to have it but uh, it gives you an impression about there are several lights in the scene and how they interact on a chromium object. See all the reflections of the light. Now let's raise this and rotate it a little bit. Make it slightly irregular. So keep in mind you need to have lights in order to see the metal. That's all I wanted to tell you. Have a nice day. Bye bye.